your place in line. That's all right. I'll let Delbert have my seconds. I won't be making any more trips to the buffet. Well, that's too bad. You're really missing out. <laughs> then I guess you won't mind if I add a few more things to the menu. I'd watch out. Her cooking sucks. You like to be bought, right? Well, here's some Benjamins. Good show, really. Well, I can't say that I won't take those off your hands. Why don't you wait till Opal's not looking? Dig through her purse. Maybe find some spare change. Doesn't look like a very big purse tonight. Why, Jill, what are you doing wasting your time with this piece of trash of trouble? I was just trying to lose her. Huh. Well, listen up, little girl. You might think you got a chance with this guy, but when he comes home with me, you'll forget all about you. Don't let me get in the way. He's all yours. Please. Good. Come on, sugar. Let's spin me around the dance floor. See you later. Well, I never thought I'd see the day you'd be fighting over the same man as Opal. When are you going to give up this game? You're the one who plays till the death. You're the one who doesn't play by the rules. Your rules? Things were going great until you decided to deal me that ridiculous prenup. There's no way I'm ever going to sign away my son. Really, JR, you should always know who you're playing with. I said no, you said we're done. Game over. I don't want it to be over. Are you saying that you want to marry me again? No prenup? Because if you are, I'll marry you tonight. I'm sorry, I must not have hurt you. How about, yes, babe, you're all that matters. I want to be a family with you again. No? Don't. Now don't try to manipulate me. I am being straight with you. Well, when have you ever really been straight with me, well, babe? Don't you think it's about time, JR? You throw yourself at Jamie, Josh, Dell, making sure that I'm watching the whole time, and you don't care about any one of those guys. I am young, and I'm single, and I'm having a good time. You do remember what it's like to have a good time, don't you, JR? There is nothing wrong with that. Not if you love me. Well, you're not exactly doing anything to prove that that's mutual. So who are you shacking up with tonight, babe? Or should I get the scorecard? One thing's for sure, it's definitely not going to be you. And you're missing out. Oh, God, don't flatter yourself. Unless you're done with that prenup, I've got nothing more to give you. But I guess you're just going to have to do the walk of shame from someone else's bed. Let me make one point extremely clear to you. I am giving up on you, but I will not give up on our son. You can try whatever it is that you want, whatever your father pulled on your mother. You can lock me up, you can trash me, but I will always be a part of our son's life until the day I die. Mama, I had to cut off JR. Now, he won't give up on that stupid prenup, and I'm not just going to sign away my son. Are you sure JR won't finally just walk on this one? I'm not. Good. Glad I'm interrupting. JR, something happened with him, babe. Well, you think you can just put on a mask and I'll forget? Stay out of my life. JR, take it easy. She's just concerned. Well, look at you. Settling for the cheap imitation because the real one's not around anymore. You know, the fake ingredients kill. JR. Last I heard, grudges aren't that good for your health either. Something's obviously wrong with you. You shut up. You're not my mother. No, she's not. Your mother is gone. Oh. Well, I'm glad one of us remembers. Oh, don't even think about it, Jack. Think about what? How great you look. The pregnant glow's really doing it for you. Okay. It's really doing it for me. Uh, would you spare me the booty call, please? I'm not in the mood. Would you leave me? I just wanted to dance. 
You can give me one little dance. No, 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 Jay, I don't dance. Oh, but we used to dance all the time. Would you stop, Jay, please stop. Okay, I've seen you with You were so wrapped up in that lying slut, you might as well be wearing a bow. Why don't you just accept it, live miserably ever after, and leave me alone, please? I see. Uh, excuse me. Thank you so much for bringing Amanda so quickly. Let's hear this new evidence. Amanda, you certainly look none the worse for wear after your stay. Why are you suddenly treating me like a human being? Has something happened? I've got some news about the drugging. This isn't about fundraising, is it? No, Tad, please, join us. Yeah, come, come on in. Why don't we invite the whole town? We can make some popcorn. Is the show gonna be that good? Before Amanda was arrested, she claimed that it was Josh who sabotaged me, that it was Josh who drugged me. Too much lip gloss went to her head. Amanda, please tell us right now exactly why you believe that to be the case. Yeah, Amanda, go ahead. Just remember, you slip up on one little fact, and they're going to use it to build a stronger case against you. Go ahead, Amanda. Remember when he claimed I erased the master tape to the Geraldo interview? Erica, I swear I didn't. She'll say anything to save herself. Let her talk. Then he gave me the wrong address so that you missed your makeup interview. Funny, though, he managed to save the day and do it himself. And that tea I gave you, the cup that was spiked, Josh is the one that gave it to me. Everything that has gone wrong, Josh was right there with me. Thank you, Amanda. I really wish we had listened to you from the beginning. Derek, we have made a terrible mistake putting Amanda Dillon in jail. This tape corroborates everything. Well, I certainly hope that you kept your jail open, because you'll be getting another guest very soon. Arrest Josh Madden. I've wasted too much time on him already. What do you have to say for yourself? I didn't confess to any crime. Were you listening to the same tape I was? I would be forgotten in a year. You really think you could do that? What can I say? I'm am ambitious. I know how to get what I want. That's not a federal offense. Don't worry. We'll get you in state court first. I would first. never stoop to drugging someone to get what I want. I'm smarter than that. You're capable of just about anything. It's my word against yours. Who are they going to believe? Multiple graduate degrees, sparkling record, or you? Do you even have any friends in this town? She has me now. Am I supposed to be afraid of that? Nobody plays Erica Kane. Firing you won't be enough. And yes, you are definitely fired. And by the time I'm finished with you, you will wish you hadn't been born. He's all yours, Derek. You have nothing against me. I did nothing wrong. Some two-bit tramp's word in a conversation? Doesn't amount to a flippin' thing. You can't force me to go anywhere, unless you're gonna arrest me. Didn't think so. Derek? I'm sorry, Erica. Thank you so much, Erica. Thank you for listening to me. Maybe we should give Erica a little space. Erica, we need to talk. No, we do not need, not, not now. Please, I really do need a little space, a little time alone. I have to pull myself together before I go back downstairs. If you're going back downstairs, then what I have to say can't wait. Yeah, it will have to wait. Please, Ted. No. One drama at a time. I'm sorry. 
I have to tell you something. Something about Josh. after you again and again. Yeah. So whatever it is you're doing, I hope you're doing it because you love him. Please, Ted, I do not want to hear if Josh Madden had something else planned for me. Oh, no. He, uh, he definitely didn't plan this. The truth is, I wasn't going to tell you about it tonight. Well, then don't. Me. No, please, don't. I am done with Josh Madden, and his father, for that matter. I'm not so sure. You may want to rethink getting even with Josh after you hear this. Okay, then, just say it, all right? I'm in no mood, Tad. Okay, so brace yourself, because this is definitely not going to help. Out with it! Erica, Josh Madden is your son. What's the matter, Dad? You afraid I'm gonna give away more of the Chandler fortune to a carry? You're dumber than a box of rocks if you marry that girl without a prenup. What the hell is that? This? This is a star necklace. Mom's. I'm gonna give it to Babe. That would be an insult to your mother's memory. Since when do you know anything? about my mother's memory. You got a kick out of using her and tossing her away when she was alive. And don't think I forgot how you got her pregnant the first time, then had her committed to get custody. I think she'd be happy that I'm giving this beautiful necklace to the woman that I love.